in shock over yeah. this news. And you know, the news of his death has touched every corner of our state. Yeah, elected officials, high school buddies, his staff, they're all paying tribute tonight to Kevin Kamenetz. And WMAR 2 News, Mallory Safaste tells us how he is being remembered. Mallory? Yeah, Jimmy and Kelly, it's hard to keep track of all the different statements and heartfelt condolences coming out. The governor, county executives, and mayors around the state are all expressing their sympathies. We've also heard from his Democratic competitors in the governor's race, and the sentiments are similar in nature. Everyone is incredibly shocked to hear about his sudden passing and they're thinking about his family, his wife Jill, and two teenage sons. Kamenitz is also being remembered as a great leader. I mean, it's a significant loss to Maryland. Uh, Kevin has been a public servant and, and he will be remembered for all of his public service and the things that he's done for uh, specifically Baltimore County. You'll remember most recently he eliminated unhealthy options in county vending machines. His staff said he was very focused on health, but he also had the ambitious task of renovating aging county schools and addressing overcrowding. And recently he announced that he wanted to make community college free to some high school graduates. And we spoke with some of his closest colleagues. We'll have more on what they had to say coming up at 530. Guys.